Hey guys, before we get into the video, I just wanted to make a little announcement. This clip that you're seeing now was uploaded um, on July 7th, and I just wanted to make this quick little announcement that's saying that it's my birthday tomorrow, and to celebrate, me and a couple of my clan members are going to be doing a Warframe stream where we're playing the new Lenaro Conclave game mode. So um, we'll be streaming that at um, about 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I hope you'll come out and check that out, and let's get right into the Zer video. Good morning, Guardians. Today is July 8th, 2016, and it's Friday, so Zer is bringing that great, great loot. He is located in the tower next to those big old doors, chilling with the speaker. Well, not, not really, but... Let's go see what Zer has. All right, starting off with the Titans, we have the Armamentarium with a discipline of 78, which can be upgraded to 98, and also comes with an intellect increase, but it doesn't give the um, thing. We, we have upgrades for special ammo or heavy ammo, so you can carry more. We have Arc Recovery, which increases recovery for 5 seconds after taking Arc Damage, or increased armor when using Arc Subclass. The main bonus gives you an additional grenade. It's really great. This is one of the best exotic pieces for Titans. Highly recommend getting it. Hunters have the Bones of Ao. It has a Intellect of plus 40, which can be upgraded to 58, and a Discipline of plus 38, which can be upgraded to 56. As um, increased ammunition for shotguns and rocket launchers, and increased agility for 5 seconds after a solar kill. Its main bonus upgrades double jump with an additional jump, so if you're running triple jump with Gunslinger or Night Stalker, you got that, four, you got that fourth jump. Um, Blade Dancers, you got that triple jump. It's really good. Um, it's it kind of goes by your play style, so if you want to use it, use it. If you don't, don't. Warlocks have the Purifier Robes with an intellect of plus 41, which can be upgraded to 61, and a strength of 42, which can be upgraded to 62. It carries um, more ammo for special and heavy weapons. You reduce incoming void burn damage and increased armor when wearing a um, solar subclass. Its main bonus... Um, when you activate Radiance from Death, it disorients nearby enemies. It's really good for, um, like those small games, but not Trials of Osiris when people are at a distance sniping your ass or shotgunning you. I mean, if they're close up, yeah, it might help out a bit, but, um, that kind of just goes by your play style, so, um, play accordingly. The weapon for this week is Mita Multi-Tool. It's probably, without a doubt, one of the best exotic uh, scout rifles, especially if you're a Crucible player. It comes with soft ballistics, co close quarter CQB ballistics, and and smart drift control. Excuse me, guys. I'm still tired. Um, we have third eye, which keeps the radar active. We have lightweight, quick draw, and field scout. And the... Uh, uh, main bonus, which um, includes this weapon, boosts move speed and fires on a hair trigger. Legacy engram for this week is the chest piece. If you're still missing anything from year one that you haven't picked up yet, this will be the thing to pick up. It costs 29 strange coins. We have the plasma drive and the emerald coil. Um, if you want to buy a Sparrow from Amanda Holiday or the Crucible or Vanguard Quartermaster, you can buy those and these upgrade them to a Legendary. We have um, three heavy ammo packs for one strange coin. Um, we have the um, very, very popular three of coins for seven. You get five of them. And three class needles for three strange coins, three motes of light, one exotic shard. And we have... One mode of light for two strange coins in case you need a couple to boost your stuff. And that's it for Zer, guys. Hope you guys have an amazing, amazing weekend. Hope to see a lot more Mita Multi tools, maybe some armamentarium, some purifier robes. And I will see you guys next time.